Sometimes we have successfully connected the iPad with the AirPods. You can start the AirPods. So you can see there are a number of sensors. So this one is the brightness sensor. If I put my hand above the top of the AirPod, then the brightness will drop to zero because there is a sensor at the top of the AirPod. So if you detect the amount of light shining onto the AirPod, then here we have the remote control. So this will move the AirPod forward, turn left, and turn right. So you can use this remote control on your AirPod. And this button will make a buzz sound on the AirPod through the speaker. And the screen button makes the AirPod move forward at a rapid speed for a number of seconds. And we also have an ultrasonic sensor in the front of the AirPod robot. So this is the ultrasonic sensor. It can be taught, it can detect some obstacle in front of the AirPod. But however, the display value is zero at this moment, just because we have some connection problem. You can see that this ultrasonic sensor the cable is connected to port number three. This is port number three. We have four ports on the AirPod. And we have to set the ultrasonic display on the app to the same port as the AirPod. So we can tap design and then tap on the ultrasonic display. Change the port to number Free. Now you can see that it is at number four. Tap number three, confirm, and then go back to play. You can see if I put my hand in front of the airport, you know, the distance will be just two to three units. If I move my hand away, you can see that the value increases. That means it can detect obstacle in front of the airport.